The gigaton music scene long criticized for its perceived lack of discipline, especially through their lyrics, finds itself under the spotlight once again. And this time round, it's none other than the legendary singer Jaguar who has shed light on these concerns. During the grand opening of the Seven's Heaven Studios owned by Guardian Angel, Jaguar made some shocking revelations that seemed to validate the industry's notoriety. In a candid account, Jaguar recounted a recent incident involving the popular Wabebe hitmaker. According to Jaguar, this artist took to the stage while drunk in stupor, rendering himself incapable of delivering a coherent performance. To make matters worse, the artist didn't stop at that. He proceeded to hurl insults at his fellow musicians, specifically targeting those from Nigeria. And the pain that story happened. In the morning, as Komoja was having a pain, the sun had caught no contact. He was ten over ten. Last man who watched the friend in the other industry in the end age. So as Komoja, he came on a KBC and Kumbuka a visit with Sanai. He caught the last one. The Jana Kaiya, he only on a Zila. He was on a Jola. He was on a Ruka. Ruka, he was on a Rasta. He was on a Nini. Just he was on a Failas. He was on a Mayashe. He came here Karis. Nikamwambia <laughs> Na sasa mimi nataka kama kuna interview uko unafanya nisikuone kwa interview nyingine kwa sababu uko na talent unaweza imba sasa the, the wakati alitoka sikumuona kwa interview nyingine kwa sababu hiyo kwa zote the next time namuona ametoa dakika i think i was the first person to call him nikamwambia sasa hiyo ndio line umechukua na muziki inafaa kwenda hivi na mimi nasema hivi kwa sababu mimi na jua wasanii wengi wakiona simu yangu wanakataa kuchukua kwa sababu nitakusomea mimi si siogopangi mtu anichukie kwa sababu kuna wasanii sasa hivi wataja hapa eh atasema ah usitumie jambo hiyo wipo atanitusi atafanya nini kwa nini kwa sababu mimi nilianza music in 2003 2004 na sikuwa na mtu Nairobi na jua tunatembea kutoka umoja mpaka Okopa Studios I struggled with my brothers naenda studio unapata hiyo time hata hakuna compare ni ilikuwa we had logobas Pili-pili, tulikuwa na Chwakali, Nameless, Redsan, Nemde, Mustafa, Lugombas, all those artists. Ukiena pale ogopa umetembea kutoka umoja, kuja ogopa, Lucas anakwambia, ingia, uweke vocals. Unambia Lucas, ah, ngoja kidogo, na eh, sauti yako hiko sawa, kwa sababu wane mastawa kupale, hata kiatu wezi toko saku, inanduka vipaya sana jiwa tenye umetembea. Sasa, ile mistik tunapanya, na mi nataka niyongee hapa. Na kama last time unajua nikiwa mbunge nilisema wasanii wanasema sijawasaidia kwa sababu no amount of legislation itakuja kutusaidia sisi kama hatuko on the right track. Sasa wasanii mahali wanakosea. Kama juzi nienda show ya tumba hii kwa tamasha. Nilikuwa nataka nione kama kuna msanii anaweza ona mmoja hivi nichukue ni msukume kama ule siki tulifanya na eti kids do. I was shocked. Kwa sababu ule msanii alianza yule kijana alika anaitwa Andrew Iso ni ibe wa bebe skido wa bebe skido akaingia kwa stage ni mlevi hata kutembe hata wale walikuwa walimuona kwa sababu kuna watu walikuwa hapa akaingia anashika mic hivi wa bebe skido ni mlevi kabisa so anai mimi kuuliza mtu haya huyu kijana hiyo song ni monster na hii song ni kubwa sana kwa nini huyu kijana anakaa hivi kijana amepanda stage mimi niko excited sije muone akiperform anaanguka kwa stage alafu akachukua microphone akasema wase mnajua nilipoteza mtoto wangu mdogo rest in peace na hapo katikati ya ngoma tukamwonea huruma kwa sababu yenyewe kupoteza mtoto ni kitu ni kitu si kitu unaweza cheka unaona lakini ukimwangalia alafu akitoka ile kitu ni nyuma akasema fuck Nigerian music mimi nataka niwaambie hapa leo open na ile kitu watu wasanii wa na mtani kumbuka siku moja music ni competition na ni business The moment you listen to Gizema, lead ya cheza local music. Cheza local music. My friend, hata wale wanatusikiza sisi. 
si wajinga my friend ukiti kama ni media sio zetu na si za serikali tuseme media inataka kutengeneza pesa hakuna mwenye msanii atakosa kucheza ile song ya kama sasa kuna song ya gospel na ikika naitwa alpha borani mshukuru mungu kwa kile hakaba huna song kama hiyo mtu atakosaje kusikiza hiyo nyimbo aweke acheze acheze yenye hakuna kitu unasema tuongee tu kweli na ni ati zetu ni kweli kwa hivyo mimi naambia kati ya nicho wewe uko kwa gospel leadership tunataka sana gospel irudi kwa mahali ilikuwa lakini even the artist wenye umesign leo nataka niwaambie hapa unaweza signiwa na Gadi Ndijo unaweza signiwa na Jaguar unaweza signiwa na President William Ruto lakini kama hujui music ni competition na ule una compete na yeye huyo ndiye adui yako hakuna mahali tutaenda tutashindanga tu hapa oh unacheza Tanzania music oh unafanya nini lakini sisi wenyewe hatuoni yao kama ni competition i am a real artist if you produce a good song today uitoe tu hata utupe CD let me tell you the truth ule wazimu ataokoa hiyo CD kwa barabara aicheze asikieni nyimbo poa ataiweka kwa catalog yake na itatoka 